Has your baby ever started crying out in the middle of the night? Perhaps Mama is wondering why it's so late at night. Rest assured that mysticism has nothing to do with this. One of the baby's methods of telling Mama he is uncomfortable is through crying. But sobbing all the time while trying to sleep is equally bad. Baby's growth and development depend on a good night's sleep. How do you handle a baby who wakes up in the middle of the night crying? See our evaluation below. Babies can cry in the middle of the night for a number of reasons, such as being hungry, feeling uncomfortable or sore, having a wet diaper, needing stability and comfort from mama, being cold or having painful gums from teething, or being overstimulated before bed. On this subject, there are two schools of opinion. The first is that when a baby notices that no one is listening to his nighttime cries, he will cease. The infant must also never be left alone when crying and must always be cuddled and comforted. According to some academics, a baby's natural biological cycle may be disturbed, which could have a negative impact on the baby's physical, emotional, social, and behavioral development. Therefore, we outlined the most effective methods for handling your baby's crying. The method is using the hold approach to deal with a baby's nighttime screaming. This method, developed by Dr. Robert Hamilton, calls for holding a baby in a very special posture and has been shown to calm a wailing newborn in less than a minute. Babies that are three months old and older are the best candidates for using the hold technique. You do this by folding the infant's arms across his or her chest and ensuring sure the left hand is firmly holding the infant's two hands. The baby's bottom is then gradually lifted by the right hand after that. Then slowly hoist the infant up so that it can see very clearly at a 45-degree angle in front of them. Dr. Robert Hamilton asserts that babies need to be capable of restful sleep until morning within a week. Because many older babies cunningly take advantage of occasions when they know that crying will result in being carried or fed, this technique typically succeeds. Therefore, this method conveys that crying games are no longer effective and that babies typically cease screaming within a short period of time. 